Now we're gonna we're gonna look at the box. We looked at the box up here. Looked at the offensive hit. Looks at looked at the the structure of how you put the box into someone. Now I want to look at the and isolate certain drills that that create the power within that box and and create it from from basically scratch. Okay, so. One thing that, that has to happen, if you step forward with the right foot, right, you have to make sure that your balance is here. Just step, just be normal. And if I push it back, then there's no balance and no, no structure in that movement. But if she pushes her body a little bit forward, her shoulder this way, her hands up, so they, they define the, the balance process, and push against this. Okay, turn your hips towards me more. There, now push against here. There you go. This is the balance point that you need to have to execute the box. Okay, you need to be from square one, start from standing position and go into it, bang. Yes. Okay, so you need to be strong in that one area to make sure that the box executes. And you also have to have the ability to be mobile. Hmm? But mobile to the point where you still keep centered on the person. So as you come in here, watch. Come in here closer, there you go. Now, if this was like a basketball game. And I'm trying to get around her, and she's trying to cover me and make sure I don't get around her. This is what the box is doing. This is the box as it pushes out to the, to the opponent, right? So if I'm here like this, and you're trying to cover me, go this way. She's trying to cover. Right? There you go. Trying to cover. So I don't get through you. There you go. And you can touch like that. There you go. There. Right? <laughs> She's, what she's doing at that moment is stopping the forward momentum, but not by passing it, by slowly stopping it for that moment and then continuing on. There's not, um, you just don't stop it and go. She stopped it and started moving as well to make sure that she's maintaining and retaining that, that, that balance distance between us. She doesn't want me to get this close, then she'll lose her structure of what she's trying to do, which is trying to prevent me from getting any closer or getting around her. Okay, so as again, this, one, this drill is again, um, it's a both offense, defensive drill. And what happens is that you've got to match now the footwork and the, the energy that's coming to me and add that knife instead of the last time when you pushed, right, this time you're going to stab. So if I'm trying to get through, she's going to use that, the mobility to not allow me to get through and plus the stab. Okay, just control it. So, so now, if I'm here, relax, right? And so I'm saying, hey, you know, blah, blah, blah. And I'm trying to get through, right? So cover me like in basketball, right? And as I come in, bang, that, that other hand comes out. Boom, yes. Just stab it, bang. Stab it, stab it, stab it. Boom. Okay, so the whole idea is, is she's putting her energy towards me. I put it on, um, do it again. Okay, just stop the stab real far away. So you just stop it here. Boom, 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 boom. So you practice that. Go. All right. All right. Okay, the point I'm getting to is that here's a novice knife fighter. Doesn't know a lot about technique. But I don't know when she's going to throw that knife. I don't know when she's going to attack. All I know is she's got me covered with her energy, right? She's not letting me go this way, follow, right, bang. So if she had a knife, I don't know when that attack is coming. So that's the drill. You can't, I can't say, okay, hit me up here. All right? So that doesn't make a, re, a sense of reality. The sense of reality is I'm trying to get by her and she's going to stab me whenever she wants. She has no rules. You formalize this into a formal system, then you're starting to pick up on these rules that, oh, you can't do this, you can't do that person on the street can do anything they want. And this is the point I'm getting at. If they're even remotely 
keen on the sense of energy and attack, and they have a, a, a motive to come after you, you know, you're, you're in deep trouble if you believe you're going to disarm them. Okay. So, again, I'm trying to get through. And with that knife, and even if she held it this way, and I'm coming and going. See, I don't know when she's going to cut. She, could, she unbalanced me because the balance of her structure was going this way. So as she did this way, she came in, even though she had balance. She still came in, and you could throw that whenever you want. But now, just throw a normal cut like this. Just throw it. Yeah, just throw it. Yes, again. Boom. Okay? So if she threw that again, go. Boom. Standing there and, and, and immobilized, yeah, that's an easy task for me. Right? She cuts again, I could go, boom, boom, come over the top. But if she's moving and covering my balance, that takes away one element from me that I don't have at my disposal. So at that moment, even if you're if now you're trying to cover me with your feet, bang, boom, okay? I don't know when that was coming, right? And I'm not letting it happen. It's happening, right? And I'm, I'm you know, obviously if I had a stick or something else, I, I, I'd win, but... Uh, it's very. It's even difficult to win with 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 somebody who doesn't have a high level of skill. That it's that that's how dangerous this knife is. Yeah, I mean we could move like this, and she's trying to get me palm. Yeah, but still she's got me covered on distance and balance, right? Because the whole drill, even without the knife, is stopping me like that. Bang! There it is. Boom! 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 Those could be two stabs. Now. The sad part is if she had two knives, I'm dead. Right, it's coming in. Okay? So, my message to you is try that at home. Try that. But please use rubber knives. But try that and see how good you fare. See how well you do. And you know, you're going to open your eyes to understanding that maybe some of the stuff you do doesn't work. Maybe some of the stuff you do may work. But put it in and take, in, take away an element. You take an element away of space. You take element of, of height. You take element of speed away. You take power away. You take something away that, that doesn't give you your full potential and see what happens. And you give that person the freedom to attack you. That's how you're ever going to know whether you can block it or not. I mean, yeah, I could have hit her, boom. But, but I still don't know whether I'm going to get cut or not. And I don't know how severely, because nobody knows. Okay? So that's another drill. Another drill is, as if you're moving like that, just, just on your own, you move as if you're trying to and then cut, cut, cut as you're doing. Yes. Keep cutting, keep cutting, keep cutting. Let's go, just go forward. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Yes, cover it, cover it. If the guy moves this way, yes. Keep your balance, keep your balance. Yes. We change feet forward, the other foot forward. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. So that type of uh, drill is very simple, but it, but it plays to the reality side of what you're doing. Okay.